Hello friends, this is Rupesh and you are watching CPP Nuts video series on linked list interview question and this is also a very important question. So what is this question? Remove duplicates from a sorted linked list. So this you can see is a sorted linked list 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, 4 and we have to remove the duplicates from this. So the answer in, after this is like 1, 2, 3 and 4. 4 nodes only 1, 2, 3 and 4. And this linked list video is part of a linked list interview question series. So you can go through all the important videos of linked list because trust me, this is also a very important data structure, not only tree and graph and stuff. This is the most important data structure and it is heavily used also. So let's get back to our question. And yeah, before starting this, you try to pause this video and come up with your solution. Like what you would think if, if you have a linked list sorted so that you know if you have to find this too you can just go ahead and look here and here and here only if you find something else like other than this two meaning after this two cannot be exist so don't you think it is uh, supposed to be a very simple logic so if you're standing here maybe you start with this but then you check is this one equal to two no it is not then you will move your pointer here and then you'll see two is equal to two. Yes, it is. So what you are basically doing, this is your current value, right? Maybe let's call it head H. Okay. So this is your head. What you will check is my data equal to my next data. So this is our head and it's next is this guy and it's data is also two. So if this is true, then what you will do, you will say, dude, I will not point you. I'll just start pointing to next of yours. So next of this is still two, which is this one. Okay. So now this link will break before we were pointing to this one. Now this link will break a new link will be formed, which is like this one. So we will initialize this one again and then see, actually you found a duplicate node, right? So then you will still keep your head here only. You will not go ahead. You will keep it here. So by unlinking this meaning initializing your current next, to next of next will make this connection and this will automatically go off because now you are not dealing with this. We are not destructing and all this. We are not supposed to, I mean, we are not asked or will not do. Otherwise you can take this node and destruct or free this memory also. Okay. But for now, we'll just simply ignore it. So now we have made this link, which is like this. Okay. So now you are pointing to this guy, but still you will see is this two equal to my next data. Yes, it is true. Then again, you will do the same thing. You will unlink this, meaning you will not point to this one. You will start pointing to next of your next, which is three now. Okay. So this will automatically go. So now we are pointing like this and we are still at this pointer only. Okay. Now you will check, is this two equal to three? No, it is not. Then you will increment the counter and you will come here. Now I'll see this three is equal to this three. Yes, it is. Then you will unlink this before you was pointing here. Now you will start pointing to this guy. How? Like this. Simple. And now again, you will check. See, if you find any duplicate node, you will keep this pointer there only after removing that because it is possible the new next is also a duplicate so that you will have to delete that also. Now you'll check this three is equal to four. No, it is not. You will move this head. And now it's standing here. Is this four equal to this one? Yes, it is. Then we will initialize this to its next. So actually this next is null. So we'll point to null. So basically we are going to insert null here and it is going to look like this. Okay. So see one, two, three and four. Correct. This is what we needed, right? Let's quickly see the code for this. So this is your code and you have this original link list. So we'll start from here. We'll pass this head, which is like this node. And we will see, I mean, we'll have a loop. See, very simple code. I'll loop through till I have heads next. Meaning, let's suppose it is possible that you have just given a single node like one. There's nothing after this. So I'll check if this current nodes next is present. No, it is not. Then I'll just simply return because this is a sorted list. The whole thing starts when you have heads next, meaning the, the thing you have received, if you have next of that, then only it is possible that there can be a duplicate. Okay. So this loop will go through whole linked list. So you have head. So this is your head edge 
and we're saying that heads next is there yes it is there so this is your next i'll call this next and see we were checking if heads data is equal to equal to heads next data so this is your heads data and this is your heads next data are they equal no they are not so if they are not then only we will make head is equal to heads next then only we will move this head pointer okay so this was head so we'll make this now your new head because it will go into this else we'll we'll go into again this loop and check heads next is there yes it is there because this is going to be your heads next now this is your next we'll check in this if is this 2 is equal to 2 yes it is if this is true then see what i am doing heads next so currently this is your head so this is your heads next position i am initializing this position to heads next next so heads next is this one its next is this one so basically i am initializing this one so this is pointing to this guy and this is automatically gone okay like this i'll keep on going and you can visualize that once i will hit here this heads next is going to be null and will break from this loop and then by that time as you see that you have removed this two you would have removed this three this two also and sorry not this four this four okay so easy right after this video i will share you another video which is about removing the duplicates from non sorted meaning mixed linked list so that is little tough than this but not so much tough so till then bye bye take care